Plutonopolis, regarding Armenia, Chicho, do you share the Duran's estimation that the Armenian government left the people of Novorno Barf alone to deal with NATO and you? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Armenia, what happened in Armenia was a color revolution, right? And the color revolution was really being pushed from the United States and France, but mainly from the United States, because a lot of people that live in the Western world think they have a right, they understand what other countries need to do, right? Which is idiotic because they don't understand, right? I got into discussions with some Armenians, relatives included, that they were saying, oh, Armenia was corrupt. Uh, it's good that Pashayan was put into power because he's going to bring democracy and all this shit. I was like, you guys are full on low IQ. You guys don't know what the fuck is going on. In the mid 2010s, I told people that as soon as Pashayan got in, late 2010s, right, that Armenians were going to be expelled from Nagorno Karabakh. This area was going to blow high, sky high. And, and we've talked about it during our live streams, Poco. I mentioned that this area is going to blow up. This area is going to blow up. This area is going to blow up. And I told the Armenians that I knew that this area was going to blow up because it was a fucking color revolution. What Armenia needed to do was maintain extremely close ties with Russia because Armenia is, is surrounded in two sides and Georgia as well. Georgia, full on color revolution there. But Turkey and Azerbaijan, the one thing that they would like to do is commit genocide, complete the genocide of the first genocide of the 20th century on from World War I and get rid of all the Armenians in that region. They want to kill all Armenians in that region. They, don't, they consider Armenians to be dogs, just the way the Zionists in Israel consider Palestinians to be, right? Is, Israeli government has said Palestinians are dogs, right? They don't consider them to be human. They're lower than animals. That's the way Turkey and Azerbaijan consider Armenians, right? And Armenia needed to hold on to Russia. Unfortunately, there was a color revolution there, and Iran, by the way. Color revolution there in Armenia, this little fucking area here, is trying to join NATO. Fucking trying to join NATO. You fucking, you gotta be low IQ, motherfucker, to fucking believe that shit, right? Turkey is part of NATO. Do you think Turkey is gonna allow Armenia to be part of NATO? Armenia wants to join the EU. Are you fucking out of your mind? Armenia wants to join the EU. EU is a fucking Titanic going down, right? So these low IQ pieces of shit just sacrificed, just sacrificed 100,000 plus Armenian peoples that have lived in a region for thousands of years, right? To fucking join NATO? To embrace the West? Fucking hell. I was talking like this to some of the Armenians that I knew before the shit blew up in 2007, 8, 9. Uh, 2017, 18, 19, right? And even before then, because there's a build up to it, right? Crazy. Ryan on Rumble. There we go now. I'm on Rumble, so they can't censor me. Ha, fuck. Fuck them. Uh, Ryan, Armenia will never join NATO because it won't meet the requirements of the alliance. Yeah, and Turkey will veto the shit out of it. What are you fucking... Turkey's in deep shit, by the way, right? Turkey's in deep shit. 